girl. I'm too hot, girl. Shit. to the airport dude this one is leaving me for the next few days sad <sighs> i'd be shook if you had mine i'm like how the heck did you get my passport i don't know where yours is at honestly <laughs> it's in my backpack <laughs> Think you staying here forever? Oh no! I mean, oh no! <laughs> Help me, please! I've been taken at the airport. I shall see you mm -hmm. in a couple days. Okay. Love you. Drive safe. You know I'm getting done. Yeah. See you. Have a big flight. Miss you too. Okay. Here. Love you. You know when you get home. Okay. okay. All right. <laughs> Bye. Bye. What's she gonna like it there? Okay. Yeah. Chowdy. <laughs> Say chowdy to the kill. <laughs> All right. Let's go back home. <laughs> Um, I must admit that I was super super duper nervous about driving because one it's Italy and I'm you know not familiar with driving here um, but I must admit it being uh, 3 a.m. is nice because there's nobody out on the road so that takes a lot of stress out of driving um, with there being like nobody out here I think if we've encountered probably like honestly truly We've probably encountered like five cars um, from the house all the way to Venice. Um, yeah, it's an hour drive, so that's nice. So I'm gonna go head back home now. Oh, oh, this is what I wanna do. Where are my fellow seventh graders at? Please just don't play with me. My paper heart will bleed. I did it, I'm home, yay. <laughs> so weird to know that like I'm alone like I know I spend a lot of time alone anyway like during the day but like it's weird knowing that like I'm alone I'm gonna go to bed alone I'm gonna wake up alone and I'm gonna be alone for like several days like that's weird but anyway I'm about to it's 4 a.m. I'm about to go get back in bed turn this alarm off that's gonna go off at 8 30 because um no ma'am all right Today's the day, Carl's gone to go get the boys, and my hot girl shit officially starts tomorrow according to the calendar, um, and lasts until next Monday. Um, but you know, we might get this hot girl shit started early today. You know, you know? So let's do that. Why wait for tomorrow, which you can start today? Also, hello, good morning again. All right, we're gonna start hot girl, hot girl shit off strong today. We're starting off with this right here. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. Peanut butter chocolate flavor. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. In the AM, it's the flavor I savor. Let's go. Yeah, Reese's Puffs, now you know. A while up in my flow. Tastes like Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. Man, I gotta give them big ups. I used to know that whole song. I don't remember it anymore. I just remember bits and pieces of it. <laughs> Eat em up, eat em up, eat em up, eat em up. To so break out your spoon, eat em up, eat em up. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. Peanut butter chocolate flavor. Next part of hot girl shit is video editing, like, you know, this is the hottest, girlest, shittest ever. All right, <laughs> it is 
now 3 p.m. Hot girl shit weekend continues to commence. Um, I was about to just eat like some tuna, like like some tuna and crackers, cause I'm hungry AF. And then I was like, yo, you know what we'll be bussing? Cause we have this kimchi that's been in the fridge for a hot minute. I was like, ooh, I could try to make some tuna like kimchi fried rice. Cause I suddenly also remembered that I had some leftover rice from the other night. Um, so I just threw it in the freezer cause yeah. So I'm gonna attempt this. I've never in my life ever made kimchi fried rice or anything. I'm probably missing half of the ingredients that are necessary, but I'm gonna just wing it. I'm gonna just let my ancestors speak to me. Even though my ancestors is black, um, you know, maybe they is up there vibing with some Korean ancestors and the Korean ancestors can tell, you know, my black ancestors how to make kimchi fried rice and just signal it down through me. So that's what we're going for. <laughs> but first I'm gonna um, thaw out this rice real quick. Also for the record, I would like to state that I did not store it in this Ziploc bag. That was Kyle's doing. When he did it, I was like, why'd you put it in a bag? Like, we got Tupperware, like, why wouldn't you do that? And he was like, I don't know. So, yeah. <laughs> I just I put some mozzarella cheese on top. You know, I gotta make this a cheesy bokumbap. Um, cause one, this probably ain't gonna be that good. Like, just looking at it, the color looks kind of sad. It's kind of mushy, you know. So, but you throw some cheese on anything. Cheese always improve any creation you make. So today we have some cheese kimchi bokumbap. All right, I have to give this a taste test. Let's see. A piece of kimchi on there, some rice and cheese all together. Um, well, it's a lacking a little bit. I don't know, <laughs> definitely missing some ingredients. Um, <laughs> probably some like gochujang or something, but it's edible. <laughs> now I'm just gonna kick back and watch some Netflix for a little bit. Take a break from editing and enjoy my little ghetto lunch I put together. Mm, come on, Korean chef. Ew. All right, day two of hot girl shit. I just washed my hair. Mm, she's so fresh, so clean, clean. Um, and yeah, it is uh, 2.15 and I'm about to go to the store. Grab some bags to take with me. Uh, probably take this big one and then this little medium small size one. That should be plenty. Oh my goodness, I forgot that, or I forgot, okay, no, I forgot that, wait, oh my god. Let me get my mind right. <laughs> I forgot my wallet at home. I don't know how, I'm so confused because I swear, like, I remember looking at it. I wonder if I took it out of my bag at the last second to like, put something else in it and then I forgot to put it back in. I'm so confused. But luckily they took Apple Pay so I was able to still pay for the stuff. But oh my goodness, I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> I was like, um, let me go check my car. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just went into this store here. It's called Lai Mai or something like this. I don't know. It's got like, oh, I think I've, I've mentioned this place before, but y'all, check, check this real quick. They got everything in there. They got clothes, they got house stuff, they got, oh, wait, wait, can I zoom in on this? Y'all see that? Yo, they selling that Zui Vuitton out there. Yo, they got that Zui Vuitton. Like, ooh, exquisite. <laughs> But anyway, I'm about to head back to the house, grab my wallet, and then um, I think I might go grab some lunch, you know, while I'm kind of 
out and about because I haven't eaten this with the exception of those Doritos this morning. <laughs> Found it. I'm 99% positive. I bet you if I run this footage back, if I did I vlog, what was I vlogging or whatever? I might have been vlogging when I was grabbing these bags and stuff. But it was sitting, it was set right above where I pulled this red bag out right at the last second. So I bet you five bucks. I had it in my hand and I probably sat it down to grab that bag and I forgot to pick it back up again. But yeah, anyway, I'm about to go and see if I can find the nearest McDonald's. Kyle's gonna judge me hardcore once he knows I did this because we made it, uh, uh, we, uh, we said that we're not gonna eat McDonald's anymore and we haven't eaten it in a very long time. At least I haven't. I haven't had it in over a year. I haven't had it since I left Korea for sure. Um, so yeah, but I don't know everyone's like, you know getting this little BTS meal or whatever and it just made me like come up with an idea of like Let me go see what's on the Italian like McDonald's menu like what do they have different from us in the States? So that's what I'm gonna go do today. I'm gonna go try some exclusive I don't know if exclusive to Italy, but um I don't know if it could be exclusive to Europe, but anyway, I'm about to go try some Italia McDonald's and see, you know, what they got on their menu and see what's popping over here. You know, this is for cultural reasons, okay? It's not that I'm hungry and I don't feel like cooking anything and I want to grab fast food. That has nothing to do with it. This is all for, you know, cultural content um, creation to share with my viewers. So Kyle, don't come for me. <laughs> okay guys, my camera's about to die, so I'm gonna do what I can. But I got this, it's called a Grand Crispy Bacon Burger. I have no idea what that entails, but that's the burger I got. Um, got some chicken nuggets because I wanted to try this salsa picante. Um, the English menu just said hot sauce, so I don't know if this is literally just like hot sauce or if it's some sort of spicy sauce. I don't know. Um, I believe this one is sweet and sour. Um, so yeah, I just grabbed those because all the other sauces seemed normal. They had barbecue, mayonnaise, ketchup, like, um, so this one seemed maybe different. <laughs> so uh, we'll try it in this sauce. Um, I got these little, I don't even know what these are, honestly. I forget what they were called, but I think they're like little cheese balls or something. I, I don't know. Little fried cheese balls. I have no idea. Um, some french fries. Uh, they have some different Oreo McFlurry flavors. Um, today I'm trying the, oh crap, I forgot everything I ordered. What the crap? I don't see that. The what did I get? Uh, uh, McFlurry Bounty. I don't know what Bounty is. I assume maybe it's like a candy or something out here. I have no idea, but I got that. Um, and then um, some strawberry cheesecake. Their freaking selection of desserts is freaking outrageous out here. I love it. They had they got donuts, macaroons, cakes. Freaking or macarons, cakes, donuts, muffins, Nutella stuff, like croissant. Like they have all types of stuff in their little mid cafe. Like, dang. <laughs> but let's try something for my camera guys really quick. <laughs> Alright, first bite, I'm gonna go in with ice cream because I'm gonna pop this in the freezer while I eat my food. So we're gonna start with the McFlurry. Interesting packaging. It's in like a cardboard thing. Mmm. That's not that's kind of good. I feel like a nougat yeah. taste to it. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. I like that. All right, let's see what these cheese balls talking about. Um, mmm, no, it looks yummy too. I think it's just Asiago cheese and speck. I don't know what speck is, but I assume it's some type of like ham or pork or something. It kind of tastes bacon y. Mmm, oh, that's really good. I should go like that. This is salsa picante talking about. It smells like. Oh, it kind of smells like, honestly, it smells like salsa. Like, like salsa, salsa. Mmm. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, she got a little kick to her. That's good, just a nice little spicy salsa. I like that. Mmm. Okay. I'm getting to this burger. See what this grand bacon talking about. I have no idea what it is. It looks like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's on this. But. Besides bacon and some meat patties and some sauce. <laughs> no, vegetable on site. Mm. Nothing special about that burger. It just tastes like McDonald's burger. I don't know. But can we take a moment to um, appreciate the paper cutlery? Like, come on, eco friendly. America needs to get on it. Like, let's go. Okay, last thing I'm gonna bite you this is cheesecake, real quick. Ooh. Mm. 
no cap the cheesecake looks better than it tastes probably wouldn't get that again mm. good morning friends <laughs> oh, i just blew out this hair um yeah so obviously you can tell it's a new day Today, so far, I've gotten up, you know, we're on day three of hot girl shit now. Yeah, day three. Um, so, so far in Operation Hot Girl Shit day three, I have done this, blown out my hair because um, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna box, put some box braids in. Um, so, this weekend, so it's Kyle and I's anniversary, I guess, like of when we started dating. Um, it's so funny. We've been dating now three years as of today, but we've never spent an anniversary together, ever. We've always been separated. And like, oh, we almost was going to spend this one together, but <laughs> he's in the States right now to, to go get the boys. So, yeah. So I figured um, I would just surprise him when he gets back because he really likes when I have box braids. And that's obviously something I don't do often. I've only ever had them twice. Um, so yeah, I decided, well, as his little present, a little happy anniversary, whatever. When do you stop celebrating your like dating anniversary? Like after you get married, does that anniversary no longer count? Do you only celebrate your wedding anniversary? I don't know. Let me know. I don't know how to, I don't know how to marriage. <laughs> um, but yeah, so, um, uh, obviously we're not like celebrating our dating anniversary or anything so this is gonna be my gift to him me and box braids you're welcome and if you black you know that this is a lot of work i'm doing so this is a good gift okay <laughs> this is a good gift for my mans to enjoy me in box braids all right <laughs> I'm actually gonna probably, um, I don't know, I'm probably just gonna put this up for now because I don't feel like doing the braids per se today. I might do them tomorrow because my arms are already tired from blowing this out. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get the little oven preheating back there. We're going to have some DiGiorno pizza. Yeah, I'm in Italy eating frozen pizza from America. Judge me if you want to. I don't care. Um, but yeah, I'm about to pop that boy in the oven and then. I don't know. I'm kind of in a gaming mood, so I might actually go attempt to finally start my gaming channel that I've been talking about doing for years now. So I might, I might do that today. We'll see. I don't know. All right, y'all know how to get the thin crust because you know I'm skinny or whatever. Um, Ignore that though, that's besides the point. Um, but yeah, I'm about to eat this lunch real quick, chill, watch a little YouTube, love me some cash stuff in videos. <laughs> I just came to the conclusion that I need some go go juice in my life. I need some gamer girl juice in my life, aka, I need to go to the stove and get something to drink that ain't water. So let's go, girls. <laughs> I'm going to the store, I need to get some more of something that I want to drink. I don't want water, I don't want no milk, I just want something sweet. The bitch ass fly break, get up out of my house. Yo, that fly trap. <laughs> <laughs> he thought he was slick, he almost made it in. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> All right. I forgot that it is Sunday and everything do be closed on Sunday, um, so uh, yeah, after scrolling, after I typed in grocery store, like supermarket, like on Google Maps and everything was like closed, 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 but guess who's not closed? Guess who wants to make money on this fine day? All these do. All these want to make money. And I know some of y'all might say, Ariel, there's no S in all these. It's actually Aldi. But you know what? Just like the K in not is silent, the S in all these is invisible. It's all these. I don't care what none of y'all say. Period. So we going to all these, baby. We gonna get some of this juice. Yo, I hate backing out of this driveway. Don't tell Kyle, but I almost took his uh side view mirror out the other day. <laughs> 
And oh, no. Oh, bound the holy grail, what I'm here for. Carbonated soda. Oh, they got that flirt. Oh, okay, what am I feeling? I'm feeling a little flirty. Let me try this limonata. Hmm. Ooh, gonna meet you someone at River Cola. Hit different than regular cola. Um, I don't know if I ever mentioned that or not, but one thing that's kind of cool is like you can like open the packs and get as many as you want out of them. You don't have to buy the whole thing as is. So that's why I think some of these are open. Let's try this. I'm gonna try this. Finest tea, Mr. Perkins. Percolation's going on. Ooh, these caught my eye too. Ooh, these flavored alcohol I drink. Oh, hold up. Let's try this, it's orange. All right, and then last, I'm just gonna grab this regular Coke. I'm not crazy about Coke, I'm not a fan, really. I mean, I'll drink it if it's there. I prefer Sprite, but I actually don't like Italian Sprite. It tastes watered down, like there's no sugar. <laughs> like, it's not, it's not, it's not worth that for me. So, in this case, we're going, we're going Cola. <laughs> Y'all, hi. Um, it's day three of Hot Girl. Is it day three or is it day four? I don't know. Lost track of my Hot Girl uh, sh tracking days. Anyway, I've just been vibing, playing some video games, and I saw something moving in the corner of my eye, and I looked over, and and this is what it is, bruh. Why is there a baby scorpion crawling on the wall? Why? Oh my goodness. That's so freaking creepy. I don't want to, I don't want to touch it. I don't, oh my God. How did it get in here? I mean, I, I assume it got in through the window because I opened the windows to let some air in, but what a freak. Ew. Ew, I hate it. I, I don't know how to, huh? ew, oh my God. Okay, oh my God. Is this, is this what we do, Italy? Is this what we do? Hang out with scorpions? Scorpions just vibing homes? Okay, it's still in the same spot. <sighs> this please I don't like this I don't like this at all <laughs> all right I took him outside I threw him in the bushes oh thinking about it I feel like it's crawling on me oh oh I hate it I hate it so much oh my goodness I need it I need a drink <laughs> I try this breezer thing we bought yesterday at Aldi's um, it's only has four percent alcohol in it, so not a whole lot, but I don't know. It looks like this looks like either this is gonna just taste really good because <laughs> it's orange flavor, or it's gonna be really awful. That's yummy. <laughs> I mean, that honestly just tastes like juice. I feel like there's. I don't taste any alcohol in this whatsoever. Yeah, I don't taste no alcohol in that. That's, that's pretty good. Um, it's really sweet. Cause I'm a child and I like sweet, so I like that. There's some other flavors. Might have to go, go take a look and uh, do a whole, do a whole, do a whole uh, trying of the whole collection on that. See how those, rank those or something. Try to splurt them on not that.
This is nice. It's very like light lemon. And yeah, really refreshing. I like this one too. Mm. All right, back to my gaming. Hot girl shit. Well, my hot girl, uh, hot girl weekend's coming to an end. I'll be back tomorrow. And as you can see, um, your girl did not complete her uh, task of doing box braids. I ended up playing video games all day long today. <laughs> Oopsies. Um, yeah, so, but that's okay. Well, Kyle don't know, won't hurt him. He'll never, he'll never know that I was planning on doing box braids unless he watches this video. And there's like a 50% chance to like watch this all the way through. I say 50% chance, actually I get a 49, a 49.5% chance he'll watch this video. And I say that because he don't really be on YouTube like that. But he does have notifications turned on for when I do upload videos. So the title of this vlog, depending on how I title it, might catch his attention. So if you're watching this, Kyle, surprise, I was going to do box brands, but I didn't. Happy anniversary. You're welcome. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, I don't remember what the last thing I vlogged was. Maybe it was me dealing with that scorpion, or maybe it was something else. I have no idea. But I'll just go ahead and say that you didn't miss nothing. All right, so that's all y'all getting for today's vlog. Obviously, Bloop is editing Ariel here. Uh, uh, and yeah, I see I'm back at home. Um, sad. So sad. Bye. It is what it is. Uh, yeah. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you haven't, go check out my gaming channel. I finally got that up and started this week. So there should be some stuff over there to watch um, by the time you see this vlog. And yeah, okay. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day, afternoon, evening, whatever it is for you and your part of the world while you're watching this. And I'll see you in my next one. Okay, bye.